I offer same day personal tarot card readings for $20. You receive your reading the same day of your purchase. Everything you need to know is in the description box below of this video for details of how to book. Thank you. Hey Virgo, welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here for tuning in. I'm just going to jump right in to see what's going on with who you're dealing with. What are their true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you? Now this is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising in the North Node, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. And I do offer same-day personal readings for $20. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you, Virgo. Okay, Virgo, so it looks like here that right now it's showing whoever this is that they have a lot of love for you. They want something new with you or they have it with you. They could be in love with you. There's something new and beautiful here with you and them. Um, and it looks like it's their emotional choice to be this way, to be here with you. For some of you, maybe it's, you know, they could be in a marriage or relationship with you and they're realizing they want to be single. Others of you, you know, they could be connected to... Um, you know, they just choose to be here with you and they're in love with you and, you know, they're going to tell you this or they have, or they, there could be someone else that they're dealing with while they're dealing with you uh, at the same time. So either or here, I don't know. But it looks like whatever that may be here, it does cause them to kind of go cold and get a bit distant and restrictive here towards you. It does make them want to kind of just move on and go on a different journey, a different path and just kind of let that be whatever it is and move forward from it looks like it's because of the truth or they want to speak their truth to you or relay their truth to you in some way shape or form tell you something possibly or maybe they have um it looks like more so it is to do something here with you or tell you something for others of you it's for you know to seek counseling guidance te a teacher some sort to figure out what to do to go inward more with themselves and kind of reflect on some things here about you know some things they have to sort out between the two of you Unfortunately, Virgo, it looks like here it's to actually become more deceptive and hidden um, and a little bit shady here towards you for the sake of their own progression, unless they're saying that they're moving, they're relocating, they're traveling, they're getting away. Um, that seems to make them happy and passionate, it looks like here, or happy or excited. Um, they're having to kind of invest and figure out what they need to do with their investments and consider their options of what you know needs to happen here. It looks like that seems to make them feel still happy with you or towards you. Unless for some of you, like I said, this is someone that has new love for you. So either or here, but it's like they still feel passionate and want a new chapter. They're working on it. They feel, you know, they're still like willing to be like loving or loyal or nice to you or friendly or give emotions or be emotionally um, committed to you in some way, shape or form. That does cause them to kind of want to wait and figure some things out here and be patient looks like the longer the wait though the more they start to kind of face a lot of things about what they have to do about them and you and it looks like they choose to just kind of go quiet or commit here to you marriage or relationship wise maybe seek some guidance and counseling them kind of just trying to figure out what to do and trusting themselves it looks like it's about you know for the sake of an idea for some of you it's about kids or children but it's for some of you it's more so like projects approaching you an idea something of what they can do it looks like um you know it does make them feel really happy and excited and passionate here with you and towards you whatever this is um, of pursuing you um but at the same time once again they feel stuck and like they've they don't really want to make necessary changes to have things happen so unless it's someone else on the side i don't know but that's when things get pretty revealing and shocking is where they're not willing to kind of make necessary changes here and reflect on things. And that's where there's, they're clueless. They run out of options and they don't know what to do. And it looks like it's more so about who they are, their position, their wealth, their money, their status, whatever this is about here and what they, whatever kind of position and career path they have here 
um, with themselves, but also with you. That's where they're having to kind of juggle everything and figure out what it is that they need to do. Um, it looks like for plans and for them to keep moving forward, there is a sense of them feeling pretty, pretty confident, passionate about what to do here. They still want to work on things here, it looks like, you know, with you or towards you in some way, shape or form in a fair way um, in regards to helping out, budgeting, saving, whatever it is. It looks like here it's because they feel, you know, they want, they have their own goals and dreams that they want here with themselves, with you, with them, but they also feel like you are their wish fulfillment and you are something that they want um, or who they have. It looks like here too that that's what makes them have a sense of like love for you, emotional commitment, or have fun with you. Okay, yeah. So for the majority of you, this is someone that's in a marriage or relationship or a commitment with you here. Okay, for some of you, this is family as well. So it's because of what they have here with you. And that's though at the same time where they do try to study you and figure out what to do and get some research and information. And But it looks like it's for the sake of a new opportunity. Okay. A new chapter for the both of you. But it looks like that is where they start to feel kind of left out, lack of something is done with you know they don't really want to walk away from something or they do they have to um, maybe they can't really rely on you financially any longer um, whatever it is it does make them kind of go cold and um we'll get a bit distant here from you which seems to give them a sense of confidence and kind of know like feel like they can they feel pretty like confident to kind of take action in that in that mindset basically for the sake of a new journey that they're you know on with themselves and it looks like that's what makes them kind of completely disconnect from you emotionally with whatever that may be for the sake of either you know who they have a crush on on the side and or for the sake of just it makes them have fun being this way here with you and towards you or kids or children something about kids or children for some of you here that's why they feel disconnected but either way it's kind of like something about that a, a child kids and or um if they're not trying to give you a message of love then who are they doing it to if they're in a marriage or relationship with you for some of you here and it's kind of like that's what starts an argument that's what starts you know a lot here of dysfunction of bullying of like name calling whatever it is here and once again, they keep bringing up something about like money and career path and business and long term and having to be independent and work. So whether it's them to you or this is just what they do, they kind of once again go back to being peaceful and understanding what's going on with the both of you and then slowly trying to make something work with you or approach you, um, but very slowly here. It looks like it's just to try to make things equal with you and make things work out with you. Okay. Um, for some of you, it's for legal matters, it's for a divorce, it's just to make things balanced and fair and neutral with the both of you or all of you, you know, combined involved in this. So you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Thank you. Bye.